I like that. Yeah. Very good. Very good choice there. Apparently discovered by XFM, is that right, Carl? Yeah, sent a tape into Claire Sturgis. You see? Big time, though. What did she do with it? Sold it. <laughs> yeah. Got a little five pound starter bag of skag. Exactly. Oh, and the rest her. is history. Well, w I've enjoyed myself. I have. But can I just say, we don't just like, you know, muck around and do stupid things and play great music. <laughs> We're also informative. And we I want to leave London with this tip that Carl, for no reason, just told me. Um, do you want to do it, Carl, or shall I tell him what you just said? Rick, we haven't got much time. You better explain it. Okay. Uh, if you got, he said you've been on the Millennium Wheel. I went no. He went well. If you do, here's a tip: go when there's lots of disabled people on there. And I, I was up for it. I went why? He went you get more for your money because I have to keep stopping and letting them off. <laughs> you get an extra six minutes. <laughs> All right. Good solid advice. If you're so maybe you maybe get there today or tomorrow. Yeah. Thanks. Song for the ladies, Rick. I'll leave you with Lamb Chop. A lot of people aren't a fan of Lamb Chop for some reason. They don't like the way he sings. But this is a beautiful song. That's the reason. Up with people. See ya. Bye. Gripes, fell in love with a girl, XFM 104.9. Five past one, of a Saturday. That's what DJs say. Of a Saturday, yeah. Yeah, Of yeah. a Saturday. Yeah. Fast approaching. Yeah, time fast approaching ten past one. <laughs> what, do you mean, what do you mean it's fast approaching? What's it speeding up, is it? <laughs> time speeding up as it gets towards ten past two. Shut <laughs> up. Ricky Gervais, obviously. With him, Steve Merchant. Yeah, and Carl Pilkinson. Let's not forget Carl P. Carl P. The K-Man. He's, pe he's growing on people, people now. Love him. People love people him. was thinking, oh God, oh he's, he's too much. Now going, they love him. Like same as you. I mean, they oh, they still think you talk a little bit too much, but I mean, they love Carl. <laughs> you know, but uh, oh, I shouldn't say that because it, it you know it rock your confidence. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. You know, yeah. No, no, I am a man of nerves. In Sorry, I'm sidetracked because I'm looking on the internet here, on the website for XFM. Yeah. Because I was, well, partly bored, but also I was looking on the other day. That's nothing I, I said, though, was it? No, no, no. no right. No. And uh, there were some people uh, commenting on the show. Yeah. And one person on there, I'm trying to find it, I don't want to misquote them. Yeah. Basically, as far as I remember, they said that uh, we knew even less about the music than the DJs that are on in the week. Right. That's, I think that is scientifically impossible. Yeah. So they've embarrassed themselves. Exactly. I think, I, I think it's impossible. You can't know less than the people. That I, I don't think so. It's, I, it's just. I mean, it's I, like it's I, like I, trying to multiply zero. You yeah. Just end up with zero. It yeah. Makes sense. I checked with Steve Taylor, the man with the knowledge. Ooh. Um, he should know. But I know, yeah. pretty. I don't think that. That's really annoying. It's so annoying because I tell you this: we are passionate about the music and we do know what we're talking about. Yeah. It's because we don't read the back of the CD box. No. Like I'm they're playing the encounter. list we're given with the, the nine CDs that are on the playlist every month. There's a piece of paper here. The car's there? looking at me like he's thinking, "Oh no, we're you, having a go." You've given away the magic. <laughs> <of radio. laughs> You get pieces of paper here and they've got little bits of details. So, for instance, White Stripes, this is the next single off White Blood Cells, February 2002. Now, it sounds like we know about the music. We yeah. made that off a piece of paper. Exactly. Whereas, when we say about music and we're wrong, at least we... It's because we didn't know. Exactly. See? All right. <laughs> Don't... Look at the All-Stars. All the old. So, can I just, I don't, don't want to criticise there, but if I was listening and I'd enjoyed that track and I yeah. wanted to know what it was, I wouldn't have understood what you'd just said. Really? Could you just say that again? Low Fidelity All Stars. Yeah, Low Fidelity, because you went, Low Fidelity All Stars. I was doing all the, I was doing me DJ talk, No, it's just, I? you didn't know Lazy. your mouth wide. I can't be bothered. No, sure. It's, uh, it takes too much, look at listen to him crinchling his little, crinchling? <laughs> crinch, you're not crinchling. You're not crinchling your Jaffa cakes, are you? What's going on there? I bet you're one of those people in cinemas that think you're being really quiet eating a bag of crisps, aren't you? Do you go to cinemas? What Tell do you do, Carl? <laughs> <laughs> Carl! What's an entertaining evening for you? Yeah. What would you do to occupy your time? 